Hey everybody, DeLongshot Signatures here. This is episode 36 of my TTM returns for this year. And uh, on this Tuesday, got back 15 successes through the mail, bringing me to 500 autographs on the dot so far this year. Really awesome milestone to hit there. Um, 15 isn't the most uh, returns that I've gotten back in a single day. I think it's 18 or 19. Uh, that was set somewhere around 2016 or 17. I uh, was getting a bunch of golf back at that time, looking like Media Marauder. Uh, he's got a fantastic channel if you guys haven't checked him out, by the way. But um, a lot of stuff here to get through, so I'll show you guys uh, real quick. But don't forget, my uh, giveaway ends in less than a week. Uh, there are details on how to enter that in some other videos, so uh, be sure to check that out. Uh, but we're going to go through some football cards here, trying to uh, get some cards that I'm missing out of some sets. First one is a 3 of 3 return from former Denver Broncos safety Dennis Smith, adding the 92 upper deck. And I think I already had both of these cards, but I had some duplicates, so if you're going to mail to them, might as well just send them all out. And then we got two of two from former Washington punter Ralph Mosienko. I've still never looked up how to pronounce his name. I think I'm just adding the 90 score. Didn't have that. Then we have two of two from former wide receiver Don Beebe. Adding the 90 Fleer. Really glad to get those. Then we have a one-of-one one from former NFL defensive back Mark Robinson, adding him to the 90 Fleer. And then we have a one-of-one one coming back from former NFL running back, and I think he was Rookie of the Year in 86? I think it was 86. Um, on a 91 upper deck, Ruben Mays. And then we'll get into two hockey returns here. First one is uh, an active player. This is coming back from the Florida Panthers. Got back Maxim Mamine. Signed there in blue. Then we have a two of two success from a goaltending prospect in the CHL. Uh, I sent to the Sioux Greyhounds where um, he was playing. And now he's in a different league. I don't really understand how all of that works at the junior level and whatnot. But got back two of two from Charlie Schenkel, who is a 2022 draft prospect. Um, I think they said he was number 12 in the North American goaltenders ranking. So really, really glad to get that one back. We got a couple of NBA returns. Uh, this first one here is a 600-day turnaround, getting back one of one from former player and uh, general manager Danny Ferry. I've seen a few people getting this guy back recently. Looks like he's catching up on his mail. And then we have two of two from former player, former head coach, and now I think he's an executive for the Lakers, uh, Kurt Rambis. Got those back pretty fast. Then we have an MLB return. This is a two of two success coming back from Dodgers pitcher Caleb Ferguson. I do know that he is in the 2019 top set. I unfortunately don't have that card and I'm not waiting, you know, two months from COMC to try and get that before the season starts. So I'm happy to have him in the collection. Um, and whenever I get around to it, I'm, I'll try and get those uh, sets filled out. I might just purchase the full base set for those uh, couple years that I'm missing a bunch of cards of. Then we got a couple IndyCar returns, um, vintage ones. Uh, some guy has been going through on Star Tiger and testing out a bunch of addresses and getting a lot of stuff back, helping out other collectors such as myself. So first one here is a two of two success from Johnny Parsons Jr. Um, he and his uh, dad spell Johnny differently, so technically he's not a junior, but he kind of is. It's, it is what it is, um, but really cool, fast turnaround on that, including this one. Uh, this is a two of two success from former driver Howdy Holmes. 
he does a little uh, smiley face kind of wink um, drawing on there as well. It's hard to find good photos of um, the older IndyCar drivers. I tried looking through on Indianapolis Motor Speedway's website and sometimes you can find good pictures um, but it's usually for you know the well-known names the Andretti's the Unser's all them uh, but when it comes to someone who maybe only raced a few years you're gonna be uh, pretty hard-pressed to find a good photo of them. And then we have a NASCAR Xfinity Series crew chief return um, this was sent sometime last season, but I didn't record when I sent it. But this is coming back from JR Motorsports number 8 uh, crew chief, Mike Bumgarner. At the time, he was the crew chief for Michael Annette, who uh, retired. I um, almost said something else. Who uh, retired at the end of last season. So really glad to get those. Then we have an FCS head coach here, uh, signing two of two from Taos, Towson University, Rob Ambrose, signed both of these photos, looks like a, either a thin pen or a thin sharpie, bringing me to 41 FCS head coaches, and then uh, got back a college baseball um, head coach return, got one back the other day from Danny Hall, who's a uh, you know, an absolute legend um, in college baseball. And uh, really surprised how quickly I got this one back, uh, especially considering he won the 2021 College World Series. This is a two of two coming back from Mississippi, Mississippi State head coach Chris Lemonis. Or Lemonis, I don't know. But uh, really, really glad to get those back. Um, already off to a good start with the college baseball uh, coaches. Their season just started, so it'll be exciting to see. I watched a little bit of a replay of like Hawaii versus someone last night, but uh, rain's coming down hard. But uh, yeah, 15 successes. So thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Helps me out a lot. Best luck with your guys' collecting. Take care.